2027. If Nnamdi Kano is released today, he may contest for president and win Tony Oyef Ofeyeton. Now to the news info. Dr. Tony Ofeyeton, Director General of the International Institute of Professional Security, commented on the political potential of Nnamdi Kano, suggesting that if Kano were released today, he could easily contest for and possibly win prominent political position such as a presidency or a governorship. Affairs to emphasize that the government's action and have inadvertently elevated Kano to the status of a hero, particularly in the Southeast region. He argued that these unintended consequences could lead to overwhelming support for Kano if he chose to pursue any political role, as his influence has grown significantly due to the government's handling of his case. Affairs remark highlight the complex dynamics of leadership perspective and the unintended political ramification of government actions. He said in an interview with TVC, if Nnamdi Kanu is released today, he may contest for president or win as governor in a landslide victory. The truth is, the government has made a hero out of him, whether they intended to or not. And now, if he decides to contest <coughs> for any political position, especially in the Southeast, it is almost certain that he would win. <clears throat> that is not even the bone of contention. The thing is, they should release him first. They should first of all release him so that he can go to be with his family before he now starts talking of, of contesting for presidency or governorship. They should release that man first of all. They really need to release him. It is, it is taking too long. Mohammed Anarewa says, he may win election under your Biafra, not Nigeria. Of course, it's going to be for Biafra nation because he's still insisting that he wants his Biafra nation. So if he wants to contest for presidency or governorship, it will be when Biafra has been given to them. He will not contest in this Nigeria because we all know that Nigeria is already a zoo. Ilo Chukado says, super story, you people have started cooking unrealistic policies against Mazinam the Kano. The 2024 election that Mr. Peter Obi won, how not winning election in Nigeria is the problem, but left for cabals to allow the winner to rule his mandate. F. Olua said, This type of talk is the reason the man always say that Nigeria is a zoo, and it's been like there's truth in it. Our leader shamelessly used to travel to another country for vacation and will not, let one, will not learn one or two things from there and bring it to Nigeria. That one, it, it, it always baffles me. Like I've always said it that these people, they travel out of the country a lot. You see all the things that are happening there. You see all their, all, all their works, all the improvements in their country and you don't say that, okay, let me bring the same thing to the country. Let us implement the same thing in my country. You see the good roads, you see the good medical care system in other countries. You see the results, you see all the kind of things that they have in their country. And you can't say, oh, let us bring this kind of improvement into my own country as well. Let us develop our own country as well to be better so that they can also come to our country for vacation. You only want to go to vacation in their country and better their lives because you are paying them money and that money they are using it for their country but you, you are taking money from your country there why can't they also bring their money to our own country do better but no they will not learn anything they will rather just go there you prefer to go there to, to to get medical attention meanwhile when you go there it is still nigerians that will attend to you what does that tell you that our people are much more better and more learning than these people the level they have over us is that they have better working systems there. But we have the hands. We have the technical know-how. Our doctors are the ones there. Our nurses are the ones there. Our engineers are the ones over there working. Yet you don't think that, okay, let us do well. Let us build all these things in our own country so that our people can come back and our countries will develop. But no, they will not do that. Mr. Maxwell says, hmm, now what for these senseless people with senseless talk? Do you do election in Nigeria? We don't know. It's the selection that we do. Selection. 
we select our leaders or they select themselves and put themselves in there because nobody voted for them. Grace Chris says, if the dude contests in Abia State, he cannot win. Not that he is not loved by his people, but Nigeria politics is beyond that. Avis Oweno says, Mazin Namdekano cannot accept to be the Nigerian president in this life. He should not even be there. should just release the man and let him go, first of all. That should be the coco. They should allow the man to go. He's not after presidency or governorship. He's up after the Biafra nation. Give them their independence. Let them be let them let them be their own 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 people. Let them select their own governors. Let them do right by their own selves. Since our leaders cannot do right by them, since they always feel segregated, that is what this man is fighting for. But because of that, you arrested him and kept him in custody. Even after they told you to release him, you did not release him. Albert says MNK is too clean to come and contest election in a corrupt country like Nigeria. It is a disgrace to his personality. I'm even ashamed of telling somebody that I'm a Nigerian because of corruption. Hmm. Musa for Christ says, Oga, go and treat malaria and stop disgracing yourself. Fairmark says it is very possible. Buy the truth and sell it. No says he will not swing governor of the state. His followers are touts and pretenders. Hmm. David Chukuneke says MNK will not, cannot, will never dream of contesting for any position in a corrupt country like this. So let no one even think of this before he was born. He is the Moses of our generation. Unoma says he is a world hero, not only in Southeast. You guys can die of your bitterness against Namdi Kano. He is not a man of your class and cannot come low to contest for Nigerian presidency. He is too much for that position. All this one is not even my business. My business is that they should release the man. They really need to release the man and let him go. Nastano says, Oga, you lack something to post. This is how most of you misbehave. One may be thinking that you have good things to reason or say. So for you, presidential election is a subject matter. You are deceiving yourself or forcing it office holder. Okay now. King Solo says he can't stoop so low to contest any political position in this good for nothing country. People have really, really given up on our country and all the bad statements that we say about our country is also kind of affecting us. We don't speak good things about our country. Wisdom says, yes, he will win in Anambra, Anambra and Biafra only. Okay, now. My listeners, what do you think? Leave your thoughts in the comment section. Do not forget to like, to share, and to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you for listening. See you some other time. Bye.